anticipate, anticipate and await that announcement. Great job, Austin, with the dodgeball reference as well. Dive, dip, duck, dodge, dip, dodge. We're just days away from our second annual FCA Fields of Faith. No dodgeball, but it's going to be fun. It's Wednesday at 7 p.m. at Harmon Field in Wapakoneta. If it's rainy, we'll be indoors at the Wapak High School Gym. It's open to anyone. It'll be inspirational, but also fun. We'll have mascot relays, including the Spencerville Bearcat. Rocky, the St. Mary's Rough Rider, running down the track. And the Elida Bulldog as well. Speaking of which, I helped kick off Elida's FCA this year on Monday. I spoke with senior quarterback Logan Alexander, who participated heavily in the Legends of Northwest Ohio weekend in July, starting with the youth camp. That was very humbling for me. It was a great experience with the little kids, meeting all the great players around here. It really opened my eyes to a few things that I was never open to before, so it all helped me out a lot, actually. And then after Alexander helped with the camp, he attended the banquet Saturday night and was encouraged by the message from the Lima area pros. Most of the athletes, honestly, uh, I can't remember his name, the golfer. Uh, he really stood out to me because he just, he had a really good story behind what his purpose was and everything was like that, so he really helped me out there too. And Alexander hoping to help others through the Elida FCA huddle. Oh yeah, I wasn't, I came to a couple last year, I wasn't too involved in it, so I'm hoping to be involved in a lot more this year. So it should be really exciting. Through it all, God is teaching him daily life lessons. Stay humble, stay within yourself, know your limits and trust other people, like especially the team, I've learned how to trust them a lot with being a young defense and those guys, so it's helped out a lot.